Dear friends and colleagues, on behalf of the United Nations Development Program and as the Director for UNDP's work on nature, climate and energy, I'm delighted to share our support for the International Year for Rangelands and Pastureless. Rangelands cover more than a third of all land on Earth. They're vital for the hundreds of millions of people who depend on them for important ecosystem services, including livelihood support, sustaining biodiversity, and performing key functions for climate regulation. Pastoralists play an important role in managing rangelands. Their long interaction um, with the biophysical aspects of rangelands means many have rich knowledge and complex management of the environment. In both developing and developed countries, pastoralists are often indigenous peoples comprising minority populations and frequently underrepresented in decision-making processes. Yet, rangelands are under ever-increasing threat. The rising global demand for food and livestock products exacerbates pressures on rangelands, leading to further degradation and desertification, a double jeopardy coupled with climate-linked drought and unpredictable weather patterns. So rangeland preserving solutions have so much potential for people and planet, and UNDP is proud to support and keenly anticipates that the International Year for Rangelands and Pastoralism in 2026, proposed by the government of Mongolia to increase awareness, understanding, and knowledge of the role of rangelands and pastoralism in SDGs, is vital. UNDP is already supporting many countries, including Mongolia, Pakistan, Kenya, Eritrea, and Uganda, to implement sustainable rangeland management approaches, integrating sound pastoralism measures into wider range and landscapes as a way to enhance the multiple ecosystem services that rangelands deliver. For example, in Mongolia, UNDP support to secure ecosystem services in multiple landscapes of the Cyan and Kangai Mountains and the Southern Gobi has successfully organized a number of herder established groups who are working towards pastoral management in more than 60,000 hectares of land. UNDP is currently supporting measures for increased risk management of rural communities in Mongolia by prom promoting climate-informed resource management, sustainable livestock practices, supporting herder communities, and integrating innovative climate-resilient technologies into financial investment decisions. And we will continue to work with countries to place, to place nature at the heart of sustainable development. We know we need nature to achieve the Paris Agreement and the SDG targets, and we will continue to support countries to invest in nature-based solutions that build on local traditional knowledge and promote sustainable rangelands and pastoralism. UNTP promises to support work on pastoralism. Climate loss and inequality requires innovative solutions and partnerships across societies. It simply must include rangelands and pastoralists. So once again, let me express UNDP's support for the International Year for Rangelands and Pastoralism and how much we look forward to working with countries and partners in addressing these challenges. We must chart a new course towards a sustainable, equitable, livable, climate resilient future in balance with our environment. To get there, the UN family will continue to rely on the bold vision, unwavering commitment and ceaseless energy of our friends and colleagues at the Global Environment Facility. At UNDP, we thank you for the efforts and we look forward to working together in these crucial years ahead to build a world with people and planet in equilibrium. Thank you.